what's up guys got the uh got the second character going here and uh just woke up internet's back on cable's back on so i guess you know what that means a little guild wars time a little frame drop too apparently and uh ooh, ooh, okay there we go let's pick him back up now like this area is really laggy so this is new character I just started and uh, we're gonna see what's up with it this is the char I guess this will be my uh, my let's play character just in time soldier the ghost army the ghost army has been bashing that gate for weeks they finally broken through fight your way to the front and report to centurion cries knife cries knife for orders for the legions that kind of reminds me of for the horde but uh whatever i like the way these guys you know basically sprint whatnot pretty cool okay all right and i have boy you can tell i just woke up and the wrong mouse out and everything i had my fps mouse I'm trying to play with instead of my uh Razor Nago. But I'm gonna whip some of these dudes' asses. I am liking this character, man. This is really cool. I'm kinda thinking he can uh he can use a um a gun at some point. So Ooh. Spiffy. The thing about Guild Wars is they make like the leveling up and they get in the skills it's just it's all really streamlined um but i mean that's that's great for me world of warcraft had a lot of issues with okay cutscene i need your help soldier tribune brimstone has ordered me to the crypt but i'm too torn up to make it what's so important that the blood legion tribune is there Ghost of Duke Beriton is far more powerful than we thought. His army just broke through our defenses. Ritlock's about to fight him head on. If he succeeds, it'll be weeks before the Ghost reforms, and we can rebuild our perimeter. On my way. <clears throat> okay. But the best thing about this game, in my opinion, as far as compared to World of Warcraft is that the skills you get I mean they pretty much just pop in there and it's all streamlined you don't have to go train and do all this other crap which I don't know to me just seemed like a needless waste of time they just pretty much play the game and all that other stuff gets taken care of For you, more or less. You could go in and mix up your skills and switch that, switch that stuff up, change weapons. Um, I'm not sure about this this character. At least my last one, I could equip like a second set of weapons, switch back and forth. They both had their own set of skills and stuff. I just, I really love how the dynamics, you know, as far as that go, are are all put together. It's really cool. What? What? Defi okay, we're still defending. Okay. Don't play this game half asleep. So the animations are great the fact that you can customize out like the face of your your character is freaking great
miss. I'm right on top of him. I miss him. Ooh. Dirty son. Look at these ghosts. They got ghosts for days, man. Just Bill Murray when you need him. So the char, I, I'm gonna be honest. Like I'm a complete Guild Wars snob. I didn't play the first one at all. Uh, I've played World of Warcraft, a couple of other MMO fail games, in my opinion. Come on, bro. We defended the gate. Got a gold medal. Gold medal champion of defending gates. Yeah, got in there that time. So I'm trying to decide a couple of things like first of all how how long should these videos be? I was wondering when you were gonna join the party, they told us to kill as many ghosts as we can. You go on ahead. These are mine, gotta love this job. Alright, bro. How about it? So uh, that's where I'd like some input. Like, how long should these videos be? What do you want to see? Like, how much of uh, of me leveling this character do you want to see? Do you want to see just like the epic stuff, or do you want to see like every second that I'm playing uh, this character? Uh, I'm thinking this char is gonna be my uh, gonna be my YouTube uh, you know character basically. I pretty much every time I play this I record and upload but the question is how much how long should the videos be and um, how much of like it's not really a grind work on this but just you know should I show just running around kind of completing a couple little tasks here and there some of that stuff or should I just show like some epic fights and you know when I get new skills or rearrange the skill tree any of that kind of stuff so uh, please do uh, let me know about that one Oh, cussing. And that is a big dude. Um, I guess I can just go up here and hit him. Okay, let's do that one. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. Alright, good stuff. So that's basically getting through like the first part of the starting area. Um, I guess I'm gonna go ahead and cut it here, and uh, well, after this, uh, after this little. I heard what you did down in the crypt, soldier. Impressive. Chibi and Brimstone was calling the shots. I just did my job. Don't sell yourself short. You were part of the team that took down Baradin and stopped the ghost assault. Smokestead is safe now, and you helped make it that way. People are still on edge, though. It'd help if they saw someone like you making the rounds, lending a hand. The quicker we get this place squared away, the sooner the legions can get back to business. You can help. I'd rather have volunteers. But if I have to issue an order, I will. That won't be necessary, Legionnaire. I hereby volunteer. Okay, so we're gonna cut it there. Uh, you guys let me know um any let's see actually let me choose my reward here um i'm gonna go with that based on just being aggressive okay so um there's a new level and uh i'm gonna cut it let me know how long how um you want these videos to be or your input i'm ultimately going to do what I want, but either way, I'd like to hear some input, and uh, what all you want to see, how much detail we want to get into, and um, if you want to see me creating this character, I've got that video, I uh, just figured nobody wanted to see it, so yeah, let me know guys, and uh, see you in the next one, peace.